Hi guys, so I'm here back again for another video on the channel. In this one today then, the Swansea boy has returned to the club. Swansea City have officially announced the signing of former Swansea City midfielder and now current Swansea City midfielder Joe Allen on a free transfer from Stoke City absolutely buzzing. So the 32 year old is back at his boyhood club after a long long spell away from Swansea City. He has been at Stoke for the last six seasons or last six years if you want to call it making 221 appearances in all competitions scoring 20 goals and grabbing 19 assists. He joined Stoke City from Liverpool where Brendan Rodgers brought him to uh, the Scousers. He played in the semi-final final for Wales recently to qualify for the World Cup so he's playing big big games in the last couple of months just shows how much potential Joe Allen still has at this level. He made 150 appearances for Swansea before before leaving and also scoring seven goals. He has signed a two-year deal with the Swans which is really good to see. But yeah, I'm buzzing with this one. Look, Flynn Downs left yesterday and let's be honest, we're all a bit disappointed. Joe Allen He's not as good as Flynn Downs in terms of his potential and how much he can grow. But Joe Allen, he's champion experienced. He starts for Wales. He's going to play in the World Cup. He is captain material. He was captain last season for Stoke. He's been captain before. He won't be captain, obviously, with Matt Grimes playing and stuff like that. But it's just another leader on the pitch. So, yeah, I'm absolutely buzzing for Joe Allen to return. Like, I know this could sound a little bit biased because, look, he, he plays for Wales. He, he, he loves Swansea City. He wants to return for the club. And had plenty of offers. He had an offer from Mallorca in Spain. He had plenty of other championship offers. We had a silver sniffing around him as well. But he decided to come to the Swans, which just shows, you know, our, our pull is still pretty good. Because Joe Allen... As much as people say, ah, oh, he's past there, uh, his best days are behind him, that could be true. But look, he's 32, he's still got plenty of games to offer, still got plenty of ability to show. And I still think it's a good signing, look, it's a good replacement for Flynn Downs. It's not, you know, Flynn Downs leaving, it's not going to take ages to find a replacement, we've got to replace him straight in. Do I still worry about a midfield depth? Yes, because we've only got three midfielders, senior ones there. We've got Joe Allen, now we've got Matt Grimes, we've got Jay Fulton, who's on the transfer list. We have Liam Walsh, but he's injured for a lot of months. And obviously, we've got Dan Williams then, who can also play in that role, but he's not very experienced. But yeah, look, Joe Allen, he'll help the younger players out. Him and Matt Grimes in midfield too is very, very good at this level indeed. Joe Allen also is capable of scoring goals. We've seen it plenty of times with Stoke before when he drives forwards and scores goals as well. So yeah, it's a really, really smart signing from the Swans. I'm not sure how much wages he'll be on because I know at Stoke he was on a hefty, hefty wage indeed. But hopefully he's took a wage cut. But yeah, Joe Allen, he's buzzing to be home. His family are buzzing to be home. And I'm absolutely buzzing to have him back at the Swans. Hopefully Joe Allen can get us back to the Premier League and you know we can see Joe Allen the Premier League with Swansea City again, but I'm not too sure. But overall, it's a really, really good replacement for Flint Down. It's a really, really good sign for Swansea City. Credit to Joe Allen for waiting. You know, because he could easily have joined another club, but he had to wait for Flynn Downs or another midfielder to leave. But Allen is back to a jack and you know he has scored against Cardiff City before as a Swan City player, so he'll have experience at the South Wales Derby. But I'm really, really excited to see Joe Allen back. He is back. Swansea Chickens Wales. He loves a chicken, Joe Allen. Joe Allen. But yeah, I'm really, really happy with this. Let me know in the comments down below, guys. What do you think of Joe Allen returning to Swan City? Do you think it's a good replacement for Flynn Downs? Do you think Allen can still do it at this level? Which is clearly yes. But the only problem is with Joe Allen. He's going to be starting majority of the season. He's got a big World Cup in the winter. <sighs> Fatigue could be a problem. So we do need a bit more depth in the midfield. So I think we do need another signing in the midfield just to keep things you know, nice and fresh. Because yes, Matt Grimes plays every single game every season, but an injury could change that. So yeah, Joe Allen, as good as he is, his age is on his side, so we do need another depth player there. We need, need someone else who can occupy in our starting 11 as well. Jake Fulton, I don't think, can do that anymore because he's just not in Russell Martin's plans. But yeah, like I say, he's got made so many appearances with Stoke, made a lot of appearances for us, played Europa League football for Liverpool and you know other European competitions. So yeah, really, really excited. Welcome back to Swan City, Joe Allen. Buzzing to see you play this season. So let me know down below, guys, what you think of Joe Allen's side for Swan City. But yeah, that's it for today's video. If you did enjoy, please leave a like, comment, subscribe. And welcome back to the biggest club in Wales. The only club to do the first league double. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you all in the next one. I need a